Some breaking news coming in. In a bid to make his party a dominant force in the Haryana Assembly polls, the BJP's newly appointed President Amit Shah is addressing a rally at Jind. Shah will announce the induction now of senior Congress leader Birinder Singh into the BJP. Singh, who met Amit Shah earlier, is present on the dais. And in what can give you a big jolt to the ruling Congress in the state, it's several senior leaders, including two former ministers, switched to the BJP on Thursday. The state's ruling outfit, which is facing a series of desertions, faced another jolt as former Haryana ministers Chattar Pal and Harsh Kumar and ex-MLA Rajkumar Balmiki joined the Safran party at its, at its Vijay Sankar rally at Mahendargarh on Thursday. Some prominent leaders of the INLD also switched loyalty and joined the BJP. Balbir Singh Saini, former minister and MLAs and former MLAs Fool Singh Kheri, Bantaram Balmiki and Krishan Kumar. Brijesh Pandey now joining us on the phone line with more. Brijesh, obviously the BJP is hoping for a massive presence in Haryana. Amit Shah, the newly elected president, making his presence felt as the day he announces his new team, hoping for a major sweep in the state. Well, yes. And uh, his, his, he's matching his utterances by his deed. And this is his second rally in the last four days. And not only this, I mean, uh, on Tuesday, the Prime Minister uh, Narendra Modi is expected to address a rally in Kethal, again in Haryana. So these three high-voltage rallies back-to-back -back and in appro approximately eight days reflects the way uh, BJP is looking at Haryana. They are making no stone unturned, even at the rally, even at the National Council, which was held last last week in Delhi. Uh, Amit Shah made it very clear in his presidential address that you know that they are looking for a victory, a massive victory in Haryana, aiming for at least 45 assembly seats with or without any uh, tie-up with HJC or any other uh, uh, political party. And and he is he is backing those utterances at National Council by holding these three high voltage rally in which we are seeing a massive defection uh, both from the Congress as well as some some sort of defection from the INLD and this is clearly showing that BJP is fast emerging as a party or of an alternative for most of these people who are kind of uh, sensing which way the wind is going to blow, blow especially in the case of Congress. Anjana? Right, British, we also see uh, several, you know, sort of, uh, you know, defectors where we see that there's a big jolt to the Congress in Haryana. Now, obviously, the the Congress is going to be able to try and cash in on this. And how do they, how do they attempt on doing that? Considering we've seen major former ministers from the Congress now making the shift into the BJP, obviously strengthening the party. Well, uh, the the Congress is uh, the Congress is fighting uh, uh, battles at several fronts. Not only its senior leaders are disgruntled at the way uh, uh, Huda is uh, running the ship at uh, Haryana, uh, they they have made their grievances very really clear to Tin Janpath, and it is after their grievances were not met to. Uh, they uh, made an attempt to abandon the ship and join the Bharatiya Janata Party. Uh, Kumari Shalja, one of the prominent ministers at UPA2, right. uh, is, is a known uh, de uh, detractor of uh, Bhupendra Singh Hooda. So is Chaudhary Virin Singh, who, is, who, will be join, who has joined the B, who will be joining BJP and sharing the dice uh, today with Amit Shah. So uh, the, one of the biggest problems for the, for the Congress is that, you know, after 10 years, there have been massive within intra-party fight, which is doing it more harm then good and and this is also not letting uh, giving the impression out to the general electorate that all is not well within the congress and uh, compared to this uh, the bharti janata party who came back on a resounding victory in the lok sabha is coming as an as a very attractive alternate and given the way things have been running over in the last 10 years in haryana the bharti janata party is emerging as a very right. preferable uh, alternative and this is one of the big reason why there is a massive swing of uh, leaders from uh, congress party to bjp Absolutely, this massive jolt to the Haryana Congress as Amit Shah is inducting three Congress leaders that have switched sides.